going on? This is the Fire HD8 Punch Red Edition. Um, it has an 8 inch display, quad core supposedly. Um, let's get into this box and see what comes inside. Now, I usually use iPads. I'm a big Apple fanboy here, I know. But uh, Amazon recently released this one for $80, and I decided to, you know what, what do I have to lose? I mean, I do have Amazon Prime. I do have, um, I think, Amazon Music, I think. I think, uh, I don't know which version I have. I have some kind of version. I know I can play music on Amazon, and I do have some purchases from Amazon. So it comes with Walwart, um, also the micro USB cable to charge it, obviously. We got a little finger tips from Fire uh, TV, Amazon, about their music service, their book service. So they have a lot of services. They have the audio service, Kindle Unlimited. Um, they have a bunch of stuff. So I got the Punch Red Edition because, you know, uh, you know, let's live a little, you know. But it's more of an orangey kind of look to it. Um, you could say it's red, but when you have direct light, it looks more orange. And it's reflective as hell. Wow. Um, two speakers on the side. Uh, we got, let's see, we got power, volume rocker, headphone jack, charging, microphone. This comes with Alexa, so let's power it up. Um, and yeah, so, you know, I picked it up, 80 bucks, like I said. Um, just giving it a shot. Uh, it's so reflective. I don't want to be on the frame, obviously, to see my triple shins. <laughs> but, you know, let's connect this to Wi-Fi. Um, Initially, I was going to go for the more expensive one, but I figured, um, you know, I'm not trying to compare this to an iPad. I'm going to see how far Amazon has came with their tablets. I mean, I did test out some earlier versions of the tablets when they first came out, and they were just playing garbage. Not going to lie, that's even before I was really into the Apple iPad. So, um, setup's easy, obviously. Um, since I bought it on my account, it already knows who I am, so there's not a whole big long process of setting anything up, which is good. I like that. Um, you also have an option to take it off as like a, as a gift, so it would come without um, being pretty much attached to my account, uh, which is you know fine and everything. And here it is. There's the interface. Um, it's you know it looks like a gigantic Android phone, <laughs> basically. Um, very reflective. I mean, wow, it's very, very reflective. Um, it, you know, it's decent speed. Um, it's not the fastest thing in the world. Um, you think it'd be a little bit faster to download its own website, but you know, it's right out of the box. I'm going to give it a shot. I do have prime so I can watch any of this stuff. Um, I don't know how good it's going to be. Obviously, um, watching on this screen since I'm used to the iPad, but, you know, as the screen's not bad, but it's also not great. Um, very reflective, like I said, um, but you know what? It is easier on the eyes, if that helps. Um, you know, it's not gonna, like, you can probably stare at this longer than you can um, at an iPad, you know, at full brightness, and just because of the quality, you know, and here's all my music. It's uh, Tupac's birthday, so we got to put that on. Um, so yeah, it's it's an okay uh, tablet. Um, it, you know, switch through apps as easily. Uh, it's very responsive touchscreen. I mean, this is the best touchscreen they ever had. I remember early on it wasn't this responsive, so it, they have came a long way. Eighty bucks, you know, consume some media. What I like about this also, it's very has a great feel to it. The the OS is uh, very uh, springy. It's like it's you know you don't get a lot of uh, uh, freezing or anything like that. So I'm really impressed with the OS at this point. And you know so I give it a shot. This one does come with Alexa. I'm not going to try that out, but uh, you know it does have a camera, which I don't know if you can see. It's pretty much garbage, but. I don't care about uh, cameras on tablets, so that's not a deal breaker at all. I actually prefer it not even be in the system. They can just take these cameras out of these fucking things because you really don't use them. Um, yeah, so that's an option if you wanted to use it. Don't, I'm not even going to try the video because I don't care. This is not what it's for. 
Um, I imagine this for just being casually reading something on Twitter or maybe even like a magazine service from uh, Amazon. I mean, I gotta say, it's very responsive. Now, it does have an orientation where you flip it to the side. It's, it has a bit of a lag to me, as you can see. It's not very fast and quick like the iPad, which, you know, like I said, I'm not saying I'm comparing it, but some aspects, I don't even know what that is right there. Why would you want it that crazy orange? But yeah, so this is me just looking at this. I'm going to be probably using this exclusively for the next two weeks. Like I said, you can put a micro SD card in. Thanks for watching this unboxing and my first impressions. Stay tuned for in a week or two, probably over two weeks. For a review of this Fire Tablet 8-inch uh, model from uh, Amazon, Punch Red. Um, so yeah, thank you. And like, subscribe if you can. And peace.